Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Uh, today I wanted to react to the uh, news of the Reds signing uh, free agent Mike Moustakis. Uh, first off, wow. Uh, this is throwing down the gauntlet. That's the way I see it. Four years, $64 million deal. The largest free agent deal in Reds history. Uh, to me, this is a clear sign that they're going all in on 2020-2021. Uh, this is a massive, massive upgrade over Jose Peraza and others who tried to fill in at second base. This guy is a legitimate power hitter, 35 home runs. In playing Grand American Ballpark, he should continue at around the same pace, if not hit even more. I'm just very, very excited. I've always been a huge fan of his, and to get him in the lineup, um, it just, it's huge because the lineup was a problem last year, and I don't, I hope this isn't the only move because I still believe there need to be moves made, uh, especially in terms of addressing the outfield and possibly the shortstop position. But for right now, if this is the first of many, I am pumped. Um, I've kind of been reading about how some of the larger market teams aren't really planning on spending much money. So now is the time for the Reds to go for it. And it looks like that's what they're trying to do. So very, very excited to get a player of Mike Moustakis' caliber in Cincinnati. So really good day overall. Uh, I think this is a shot of energy and excitement that the fan base in Cincinnati needs. And as of right now, it's looking like the infield will be you know, around the horn, you got Barnhart at catcher. They probably need an upgrade there, I believe. Vado at first, Mustak is a second, Galvis at short. I think they could uh, stand for an upgrade there, possibly with DJ Gregorius or uh, Jonathan Villar. Um, and Anu Eugenio Suarez uh, rounds out the rest of the infield. So, great, great news, great day, very excited. Um, yeah. Uh, I didn't see this news until I got off of work and I basically, I dropped my job because the Reds typically don't spend this kind of money on free agents. And so it's a sign of the times, a sign they're ready to go for it. And I'm all in with them as well. So anyway, as always, thank you guys for watching. I'll talk to you later. Take care. Bye.